Hi everyone! I have a, another mini album to show. Um, last week I watched followingthepapertrail.blogspot.com as Laura made um, a mini album out of envelopes on her Ustream channel. And I thought, well, heck, I like that. I'm going to give it a try. And with a few alterations of my own, I made one. Um, I'm going to kind of go over the supplies that I used in case you're wondering um, how I made it or what I made it with, so you'll know. The flowers on the front cover are made out of muslin that I dyed with Glimmer Mist. I used these four colors to dye the flowers. Chocolate, Frost, Caribbean Blue, and Sherbert. And then I just hot glued um, buttons to the front of it, tied a little bit of yarn inside to add the centers to it. The leaves are actually a five petal, uh, excuse me, a six petal flower from the Color Me Crazy petals from Petaloom. Uh, and I dyed it with Glimmer Mist, the olive vine, which I don't have here, but anyways. I made the binding out of just hair bands that you can get at Walmart. You can get them in all different colors. So I took um, two of the white ones and I attached it, I'll show you on the back, with these swirly paper clips. And I cut the center out of one of the bindings out of the one of the swirly paper clips because it just wanted to hook over if you you could hook it without doing that except for they kind of get tied in a knot and then you can't undo them easily so we'll just kind of go through it and as I um, come to something that I used I will show you hopefully the product that I used on it anyways you just unhook the front the whole album is about giggling I I got from scrapbuck.com a, a stamp set from Kelly Penich, Penanichi, and the whole stamp set is giggles and chuckles and smiles and laughing and that kind of stuff. So I did the whole mini album based on this stamp set. By the luck of the draw, I also happen to have a paper pad from My Mind's Eye. I probably got it at Hobby Lobby or something like that. It's the Simply, Simply Delightful My Mind's Eye set and the paper in it actually had a whole sheet of paper that was all about chuckling and uh, giggling and all kinds of smiley stuff so it worked out perfect it was a pure accident I didn't even realize that the paper matched it until I had it covered because <laughs> I hadn't read the words anyway so this is the mini album all of the inner pages are made with basic white envelopes and let's go through it Basically, it, it opens up in an accordion style, and inside it you have pockets. And normally I wouldn't go through all the tags, but the tags are what took me the longest on this because I challenged myself to use a different um, stamp from the stamp set on every single tag. So I'll show you what I did. This one I embossed with clear embossing. Stamped it with the Versamark, used clear embossing on it, and then I just used um, Broken China to highlight it. And on the back of all of them are journaling lines. This one, I used the Giggle with a smiley face stamp. You open it, and it just keeps folding open. It's pretty cool. This one, I used the Iridescent or Kaleidoscope. Um, embossing on and it didn't stand out real well but I think it turned out cute and then there was a little flower stamp that I stamped in the broken china oh on this one I used on the all the pink ones I used Victorian velvet my favorite of the new colors this one on the blues I used stormy sky And again, they're all journal lined. And then on the tans, I used tea dye. And this is just Versamark with a background stamp. And then the cool thing about this album is when you flip it over, you have more pages on the back. So I have it like this. 
And this one again is with the clear. I don't know how well that's going to show up, but and then I just colored in a graphic shape there. Lots of spots. Giggle. The sound of happy. And then my favorite. Warning. Giggles are contagious. They may cause a bellyache. And again, they're all lined on the back. I'll show you the back of this one. This is how I hooked it on. I this is the back of the mini album. And what I did was I took a paper clip and I attached the hairband to the paper clip, crumper chomped two holes, and added uh, bow bunny brads that I glued down really, really good um, through the, the chipboard covers so that it would be really, really secure. And basically, that's how I hold the binding on. All that you have to do now to re-secure it is to hook it up. I want to thank Laura from following the paper trail for another awesome, inspiring mini album idea. Girl, you rock my world when it comes to mini albums. Thank you so much. Um, I think that's it. Thank you so much for stopping by, everybody. I will see you around. Have a great day. Bye.